I tend to be very hesitant when, when it comes to prayer for healing. I always challenge God, like, God, when will I have the instant healing? I realise that it's really not about whether you deserve it, whether are you a good person. I know that God healed me. His healing gifts are flowing right now. I see vertebrae that are worn out. All right, worn out. And that's what's causing you pain. I injured my back when I was uh, doing some circuit training. I felt a sharp pain on my back. And the pain was there for the remaining weeks. I even need to sleep with my leg raised. When Pastor Prince to the broadcast asked those people who have uh, back pain to stand up, I remember very clearly that when Pastor Prince started to mention things like uh, there's a renewal of the vertebrae. I see the Lord restoring discs and vertebrae. I know in my spirit that something happened. The pain is leaving. I can feel the heat flowing through. Then the pain just left. God is real. Jesus is the only one, the healer. Someone with a tooth condition, back, right, upper tooth, okay? And you have that bothering you. That's you, sister. Receive it, sister, in the name of Jesus. Father, heal that tooth, Lord. Immediately, the pain gone. And until now, the pain is not come back anymore. I went to do a chest x-ray, and then a couple of days later, the doctor called me and said that they found um, something you know, in the lungs. So 10 days before the second appointment, I attended a second service in uh, Woodlands uh, Causeway Point. During the testimonial um, session, pastor was uh, reading out you know, about a few sisters who got healed of their ailments uh, in the previous week. And then I remember thinking to myself, I was like, oh, you know, I hope that this week pastor would, he would call up my ailment and the church can pray for me. I see a pair of lungs and I see like uh, you, you have had an x-ray done and, and there were dark spots. Oh, it's me. You know, he's calling out for me. At the moment, I, know, I knew I'm healed already. Right now, uh, God is touching your lungs. Amen. I see that, 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 that black dot that removed completely in your next x-ray you will see what the Lord has done. I went to do an x-ray, and then immediately after, I get to see the lung specialist. And the lung specialist uh, showed me the two x-rays side by side. And they say, this was your before and this is your after. He pointed out the areas that has the dark spots, and then he showed me, you know, the part that was clear. I can squat. Oh, I can bend down completely. I came with uh, my left knee cap condition. It was here for almost three years. Uh. I cannot walk down the stairs or squat down. I see someone with uh, your knee is all swollen and it's not the first time it's happened to you. In that service, when I responded, uh, I felt a warm sen sensation in me. Uh. So after the service, I went home and I told my wife, hey, Seems uh, my kneecap problem is already gone. Uh. I don't quite believe I move my leg around, also try squatting down, try jumping. It's all gone. The Lord is healing people of chronic headaches. If you have a chronic headache, in fact, one, uh, one person here is having a bad headache. I was like, what? Is it me, Lord? <laughs> In the middle of the sermon, I feel like, wow, I, I, my head is not aching anymore. It's so special to me and it's the way of the Lord telling me that, hey, I know how you feel. So there's this one Sunday morning where I was feeling a discomfort in my chest here uh, on my way to service. I was a bit concerned when I, when I felt that way like, because uh, I have a history of heart condition and I have a pacemaker here also. So during service, um, Pastor Prince came out and then he started praying for people for healing and he was praying for people with heart conditions and heart attacks. And then he mentioned people with breathlessness and people with uh, discomfort in the chest or so. So I was like, amen, that's me. It wasn't live. So when Pastor Prince was asking for people to stand up and everything, I, I didn't. It's just immediately the, the discomfort went away and, and for the rest of the day or so, I didn't feel any more discomfort. People in the uh, different services as well, the anointing of God knows no time. God really works through time and space. Wherever you are, you know, whatever time zone you are in, you can be in other country, you can receive the exact same anointing. There is someone here 
you have pain right, right, right down uh, where your tailbone is causing you pain. And when you sit down, it causes you pain. I've been seeing a physiotherapist, which hasn't been helping at all. There was no results. Is that you, sister? The one in, in black? That's you, right? And just so miraculously, I was sitting at the area where he pointed at a woman. The woman in black checked your body. And I was wearing black as well, so it was quite crazy that, you know, like even the seating arrangement, the clothes that I wear, like, it, I felt like the service was just catered to me. Pastor wasn't there at fourth service, but I got healed. I tend to be very hesitant when, when it comes to prayer for healing because sometimes it takes time for the manifestation to come. So when this was like so immediate, I was, I was really happy. Like, I really praise God that God just gave a hundredfold immediately. 